So, Mr. Gratz, what advice would you have for students regarding next semester? Why is Luke standing here? What's his purpose exactly? <laughs> I have a lot of advice. First off, be more consistent. Do your work more yeah. consistently. And the effort piece. Most kids don't do well because they don't give the effort. So effort and consistency will lead to success. Why, thank you, Mr. Thank Gratz. you. What is some advice you have for next semester? Um, the advice I would give for next semester is to remember that it's a fresh start and even if you didn't do as well as you were hoping first semester, it's a clean slate and you can always um, improve and just don't give up. Keep what is some good advice you have for starting the next semester? Thanks, Jolie. Uh, I think my biggest advice for starting the next semester is just take advantage of the fresh start. I like the new semester because whatever your grade was second quarter, um, now you're back to having no grade, and so every little assignment you get, if you take it seriously, you can keep that grade up, and even if you didn't like your grade in the past, you get a fresh start, and um, you can change it pretty easily. So this is the best time to fix something that you're not happy with about school. Thank you. You're welcome. What's some advice you have for starting the next semester? I would um, say that uh, just having a positive mindset, thinking, you know, you can do it is a great way to start the new semester. Also, um, if maybe you struggled this last semester, don't get discouraged by that. Um, there's that whole power of yet, if you don't know something, you know, how can you change it? Um, how can you change your thinking so that you do understand it? Um, also, if you're all the teachers here want to help you, so if you're confused by something, don't wait until the end of the semester to ask for help. We want to help you, so that would be my advice for Thank you. how to rock this new semester. If you could go anywhere in the world, where would you go? We asked around, and you guys had some pretty interesting answers. If you could go anywhere in the world, where would you go? Uh, New York. If you could go anywhere in the world, where would you go? Um, Hawaii. Why? I like the idea of volcanoes. Nice. If you could go anywhere in the world, where would you go? The Maldives. Why? Because it looks cool. <laughs> If you could go anywhere in the world, where would you go? Um, New Mexico. If you could go anywhere in the world, where would you go? Uh, Madagascar. Why? Because uh, of the animals and culture. If you guys could go anywhere in the world, where would you go? Somewhere where I could sleep for 24 straight hours. Somewhere I could lay on a beach for 24 straight hours. Yeah. <laughs> nice. You could sleep on a beach. No, you'd, For get 24 really, hours. you'd get a really bad sunburn. Not if you had SPF like 90. But then you have to reapply it. I could do that. If you could go anywhere in the world, where would you go? Well, I've already been to Seattle, but I want to go there because it's really fun. So just going to Seattle would be fun. Nice. If you could go anywhere in the world, where would you go? I would want to go to either Bora Bora or Hawaii. If you could go anywhere in the world, where would you go? Uh, China, because I think it looks cool. What's your favorite restaurant? Uh, probably El Sombrero. Why do you like it? Because I like their tacos. Okay. Mr. Church, what's your favorite restaurant? Uh, favorite restaurant in Lewiston is Thai Taste. What do you like to get there? Uh, garlic Delight's really good. I like the Pad Thai with shrimp. Um, I like just about anything they have, but um, yeah, probably Garlic Delight is my favorite. And Carter, what's your favorite restaurant? Um, probably KFC. What do you like to get there? Their mashed potatoes. What's your favorite restaurant? Um, I probably have to say Casey's Burgers and Brews. What's your favorite thing to get there? The chicken strips. What's your favorite restaurant? 
Well, as many restaurants I like, but my favorite here in town is definitely the Roosters. They have good food, and I like how you can look up the windows and then see the Snake River. Where do you like to get there? Chicken strips. Mr. Warner, what's your favorite restaurant? Oh, China Buffet, because they got Mongolian barbecue. You can pick what you want, and then they cook it up right there for you. And, oh, so good. So 